So it's time for another minimalism series video. If you haven't seen any of my videos before, hi, I'm Rachel Us. It's taken me a little while to get back into these minimalism ones because I didn't know which one I wanted to do next and how I wanted to film it and all that sort of thing. So this time I have decided to focus on how to keep your digital life more simplified. So I'll be showing you things on my computer and I'll be showing you things on the phone as well. If you want a more in-depth look at the apps and everything that I do keep on my phone to help me stay organized, that's in my watch on my phone video. I posted that a week ago, two weeks ago. I'm not sure. Anyway, I'll put a link in the description box so you can find that one if you'd like to watch it. What was that accent? This video will be covering how to keep everything organized digitally when you do have to work a lot on your computer. So I'll be touching on emails. I mean, I have multiple email addresses and I have to because I'm part of different companies. So I'll be going through all of that sort of thing. If you do enjoy the video, I'd love it if you would give it a big thumbs up if you're feeling nice. And I will take you through my tips now. Keeping your computer organized will help make you more productive and also it will help your computer run a little bit better when it's not clogged up with heaps of files that you're not using. Try to keep your desktop empty. I've got my mailbox, I've got Final Cut Pro, Google Chrome, and then QuickTime Player sitting there just because it is recording this screen grab. Make sure you have a really good filing system for all of your documents and name things properly so that you can find them later. I like to empty my downloads folder weekly, just to make sure there's nothing sitting in there. Be pretty ruthless with this one. It's also a good idea to keep an eye on your bookmarks. These can easily get out of control. Use your bookmarks manager if you're using Chrome, it'll make it really simple. Back up all your files to a hard drive and also to a cloud system. I like to empty my trash weekly as well. This makes sure there's no junk files just sitting around on my computer. I won't show you too many of my emails because there are some personal ones in there of course, but I can say try to get to inbox zero as often as possible, unsubscribe from mailing lists that are just trying to sell you things all the time, but you can keep blogs there if they're helpful. So I like to follow a couple of blogs that have tips that I find very handy, but things that are just advertising, I'll often unsubscribe from those. When it comes to your mobile phone, make sure there's no extra apps that you're not using, just sitting around. And I like to use an app called Flick to help me get through my photos and sort what I do and don't want to keep. Also, remove any phone contacts who you're not in contact with. So my tips are daily, clean up your desktop of your computer, sort out your emails. When it comes to weekly, you're going to want to back up your files. So on the hard drive and on the cloud system, empty your trash folder and empty out your downloads. For a monthly checkup, you're going to want to unsubscribe from marketing mailing lists and you're going to want to check what applications that you have in your computer. If you're not using them, get rid of them. Quarterly, you're going to unlike pages that aren't necessary and you're going to unfriend people who you don't want to have on your friends list anymore. And you're also going to do a big image cleanup. So get rid of the files that you don't need. If you've learned something new, tell me in the comments. I'd love to hear if any of my tips are able to help you out and get a bit more organized with your digital life so you're not so cluttered up on your computer. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you do like this video. I do have more minimalism series coming soon. If you have a request of what you'd like to see, like if there's an area that you need reduction in, then drop me a comment as well and I will see if I can get to it for you. Anyway, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day or night or whatever time it is where you are and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! And cupcakes. How often are you eating these donuts and cupcakes? I would like to answer this one and I would like to